Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to um, set up your R4 so you can play games and put um, multimedia on it. So you're going to need an R4 cartridge and you're going to need a micro SD card. Make sure that it's not a HC card because um, R4s are not compatible with that. And you'll need a USB micro SD card reader or anything else that can read um, micro SD cards. And you're going to need a DS. So, now that you have all these things, what are you going to do with them? Before we go onto the computer, you're going to want to put in put your micro SD card into your card reader. Plug it into a USB port on your computer. Okay, so now you want the firmware to set up your R4 card. So you have to go to this site. I'll put a link in the description for you. And when you get here, you're going to click this flashing um, link right here. It's going to come up with this page. And you're going to either download the English version, the Korean, or the French version. And once that's downloaded, and you've extracted the content, it's going to look like this. You're going to have two files and two folders. You're going to copy all four of those and you're going to put it into your micro SD card. Just copy and paste it over. And once that's done, your card is set up. So Romulation is one of my favorite sites to get my DS games from. Um, it has a easy and simple layout as well as it has um, certain little things that make it much easier for you to find games that you want. So say you wanted the G.I. Joe, the Rise of Cobra game, here it'll have all these things in um, brackets and some people when they're starting out have no idea what this means. The U is pretty much what you want, like these little letters, the letters in the brackets are pretty much what you want to know about and so U stands for US version or North American version J Japanese version E will be the European version which has multiple languages and um, some of them even have only one language such as this one has I which is Italian only so this website I think is one of the easiest to navigate and find the games that you want in the right language um, so let, let's just click on this Alright, so it, it has some um, pictures for you, screenshots, and it also has uh, these other tabs here. So it has a comment tab, which allows um, you know people to comment on how good or how crap the game is. It also has a similar game download, which allows you to find other games that you could be interested in. And as well as the download tab. So you'll have the North American server and the Europe server. Sometimes they also have mirrors. Um, sometimes the servers aren't working, um, but you can still get it from RapShare and Mega Upload if they have it. This one doesn't have it because I because it's really new. So, as well as the DS games, this website also has Game Boy Advance, a Nintendo 64, PlayStation, Sega, Dreamcast, and so many other older games. Unfortunately, the R4 can only play Nintendo DS games right now. Okay, so you've downloaded a game, now what? You can open up the folder and it's usually going to have three items in it. The only one that you really need is the NDS file which you should copy and paste and put it into your micro SD card. Once that's done, your game has been installed and it's ready to play. But now you just gotta safely remove your device. So, once you've safely removed your SD card, take it out and put it back into your R4. Then put the R4 into the Nintendo DS, obviously, and turn on your Nintendo DS. Um, yours is not going to look like this because um, I have a Harry Potter theme on here. But um, it'll just say R4 Revolution or something like that so not to worry so you're gonna go to your games 
and as you can see right here is transformers and it should work no problem hopefully this helps some of you and if it did comment rate subscribe and thanks for watching